Welcome to this video on self joins. My name's Andy Wicks, and in this video, we're going to look at a topic that can seem a little awkward at first and maybe a bit pointless, but as you'll see, it has quite a good use. So let's get started. The problem that we're going to look at is using the second hand bookshop scenario, as in all the previous videos. Imagine that we had a problem with a customer who travelled a long way to get to the bookshop because we had the title she wanted. However, when she got there, she found that the title was correct, but it was a different book. Now, this is the sort of thing that could well happen. So we'd like to overcome that. And for that, we need self joins. How do we find books whose titles are the same, but are by different authors? Here we want to compare the titles in the table book with each other. But how can we do that? We need a self join. And this is where a table is linked to itself. Self join is where a table is used twice. Each copy of the table becomes a view. So how does the DBMS know which version of the table to use? Well, that's quite simple we're going to be using aliases. So for example, we might have something like from title T1, comma title T2. You'll notice that the name of the table is the same, but the aliases are different. Each alias becomes a view. So when to use self joins? You use self joins when you want to compare items in a single table. So, for example, the two titles are the same, but different books. Notice that we have to exclude ones where the title ID was the same. This is the opposite of what we would do normally. In this case, we have to do where the primary key is not equal to the foreign key. So what would the sequel look like? The sequel here has a from statement that uses the title table twice, once as T1 and once as T2. We can then move on to the conditions. Here in the WHERE clause, we're linking by the title field. So we want it to be where the titles are the same. But if a book is called Fred, a book is called Fred. So it'll be Fred in title and in title. T1 and T2. So what we want is to exclude those where the title ID is the same. So and not T1 title ID equals T2 title ID. In that way, we only get those titles where the title is the same, but the IDs are different. So when do we use self joins? Self joins are used when you want a subset of a table. So, for example, a list of employees by department or a list of those in a family tree with the same family name. You can then use this subset as an input to another query. And this can simplify the logic a lot. Thank you for watching. 